name is Sarah and welcome to my channel. Today is a very exciting day. Recently, I have subscribed to a certain box subscription service. You know the kind of thing you subscribe, you get a box in the mail either every month or every second month, that kind of thing. Well, yesterday was the day that I received this said box that I have subscribed to. Here it is! Look at it! It is the JK Rowling's Wizarding World box from Loot Crate. I am so excited. I have been waiting for you. You have no idea. It's finally here. Yeah! This box right here is a bi-monthly subscription service, which is super exciting because who wouldn't want to get magical goodies delivered to their doorstep every second month? I mean, had I had the option of getting it every month, I would have totally opted for that. But this way is fine and I'm okay with it just the same. Now, I usually watch these unboxing videos of certain YouTubers that also receive this particular crate, but I made sure to not go looking for those videos just yet. I was also really careful to not stumble upon something online that would spoil the contents of what's inside this box. I just really wanted to wait to receive my own box so that way I was genuinely surprised and I got to experience the full magical experience for myself. Ooh! Mm, yeah, that just happened. So all that being said, let's just get on to opening it. So here's the box here. It just says JK Rowling's Wizarding World on the front. On the side, it just says powered by loot crates. And here there's a sticker here that I believe is supposed to just kind of go over the flap. Mine was kind of open and tucked in underneath, so I hope nothing fell out or there's nothing missing. But basically, it's a sticker that says muggle-worthy. I don't know if you could see that. Kind of like, you know, on Newt's suitcase. Let's just open it. Whoa! What is this? This is so pretty. Okay, there's just so much to look at right now. Inside the box, it looks like like Newt's suitcase. Or just a suitcase. There's the um, Hogwarts logo on it. And then this is what I can see from it. So there's just this big thing on the top. I'm just going to put this down and pick from the box and show you. This is the first thing that we can see that's on the top of the box. It is an office stationery set. It's um, like a Makusa theme, which is the Magical Congress of the United States of America. So we have a folio, sticky notes, two paper clips, and a list pad. I must say I have a thing for stationery, so this is quite great. <laughs> That's the first thing in the box. We're off to a really good start. I like it. All right, so the next thing in the box that I see is this little pink box. Let me just get the plastic off of it so that way we can see what's inside. Penny Dukes is the store where you can get all of the magical goodies in the wizarding world. They made very clear to put on the box that it's not edible because that's where you can buy like all of your sweeties or your candies. And it's a eraser set. Chocolate frog, sugar skull, jelly slug, and a cauldron cake. That looks so convincing too. But for example, the chocolate frog, it actually looks like chocolate. You can't eat this frog. And a sugar skull, which is that one. I don't know why you'd want to use them. They just look too pretty. And then a jelly slug. I actually can't wait to go to the Wizarding World. It's like on the top of my bucket list. And then I'll get to actually eat the real versions of these things. And then the cauldron cake. Cauldron cake. Very cool adding to the stationary stuff. Now this is just calling me is a Gryffindor scarf. Another really cool thing about this subscription box is that you can specify your house. So whenever they have house related items in the boxes, you can get your own house. So I was sorted in Gryffindor on Pottermore. I mean, I knew I was a Gryffindor to start, but this is a beautiful scarf. It has the little tassels at the bottom. I think I'm just going to have to put it on for the rest of this video because it is beautiful. Oh, I forgot to mention, it's a Loot Crate exclusive, which means that you can't get this scarf elsewhere. So I guess the one at the Wizarding World they look a little different. Just going back on the stationery set is also a Loot Crate exclusive. And um, so are the erasers from Honey Dukes. Wow, only people subscribed to this box will ever get these things. The next thing in the box is a little packaging like this. Ooh, Ollivander's Harry Potter wand pen. What? That's so cool. 
it is a wand pen. Let's get it out. Oh my god. You just pull it out and there's a pen. And you can just write on things. This is the best pen I have ever had. What color is the ink? For those wondering the color, it is black. This box is so good. It is so good. And what seems to be the last thing in the box? So I have it out of the packaging. It says Harry Potter on it. And oh my goodness, it's the locket medallion. It's very well made because it's a double back pin because it is a bigger, heavier pin. So that way it'll secure nicely on your jacket or on your scarf or whatever you're putting it on. So yeah, that's really cool. It's like the face of the locket medallion, the horcrux that Ron and Harry have to destroy. That is everything I got in the box. The last thing in the box is just the um, list of the contents in the box. List of magical must-haves. Whether you're headed back to Hogwarts for a new school year full of adventure or in need of organizing your desk at Makuza, you'll need to equip yourself with some essentials only found in the wizarding world. Don't worry, this crate has you covered. And they are all Loot Crate exclusives like we saw. Quite impressed. This box was just so good. So good. So worth it. So yeah, that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing with me. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!